up, what up, what up? It's your boy, Jada King Hefner, and the beautiful Secretary Sunat A Star. And we're back again for another show. And the title of this episode is Companionship is Stronger. Companionship is Stronger. And what do I mean by that? We'll get to that right about now. Hey guys, help me welcome Four Nuffton Stem to the Dog King Army. We really appreciate him joining the team with Inner Team, and we really hope you will consider joining us as well. With all that said, let's get back to the show. Hey guys, I'm back again with the beautiful Secretary Sunade, and the title of today's show is Companionship is Stronger. And I got the idea to do this show because even though I don't have sex with my companion dogs, we have a very strong bond. And honestly, I really don't notice it most of the time. I'm human, so I do have urges just like everybody else. But whenever they come, I take care of that situation myself and me and the girls resume our relationship as normal. And what I realize is I don't even think about that aspect of our relationship. And that's major because I'm a very sexual person. It's no way I can sit up for months and months and months without having sex with a human woman. Because whenever you're not having sex with that human woman, you always have to wonder what the hell is going on. Whether she's making you wait or whether both of you have decided to wait on sex together. In the back of your mind, you always have to wonder, am I being a damn fool here? Am I waiting while she's having sex? And no matter how much you want to deny it, that thought will pop up in your mind. And that's a thought that never pops up in my mind with my companion dogs. I never have to wonder if they're out in the streets and they're going to cheat on me or do anything like that. So it's so easy not to have sex with my dogs. I don't have to feel like I'm being rushed because my girls are there if I desire them. And I also know there are dog owners out there that just use their companion dogs for a sexual nature. And as I've said before, it's nothing wrong with it. You can use your dogs in whatever way makes you the happiest. But I just feel when you use them only for a sexual purpose, then they become things that you can put away until you need them. But when you build up a bond of companionship with your girl, it's a lot stronger than just having a sexual relationship. Because when you have the companionship aspect, you're going to want your girl to be with you at all times, just like a human girl. You won't be looking at her like a toy or something that you just use for pleasure. And that's why I say sex is good, whether it's with a human counterpart or your companion dog. But at the end of the day, I believe companionship is stronger. You can be with your dog a few times for a sexual purpose, but when you use them for companionship, you'll want them around all of the time. So, with all that said, we really love for you guys to hit those subscriptions and notifications. But as of right now, it's been me, Jada Akin Hefner, and the beautiful Secretary Sunade Stark.